Well, hello there, Shula. Oh, hi. <laughs> we are a non-medical caregiving company, which means that we do uh, house, light housekeeping, we do incontinence care, we do field trips, we, you know, sit by the bedside, hold your uh, hands. Will you pray for me? Absolutely. Okay. We uh, you just need someone to pray with you. Whatever the need is for the patient, then that's what we, we are there for. You know, we started out with a daytime only, and so it was a group of maybe three or four people in rotation. Eventually, my father had round-the-clock care, and as we needed more, she was always able to add to her team of people that worked with our fathers. So I like to make sure that families know that there is someone that is on your side that will be an advocate for your parent just as well as you are or your child or you know when you're not there. Someone you could trust, someone that would you know take care of your loved one the way that you wanted them taken care of, someone that would listen if you had questions or and just someone that you could talk to for advice. It takes the love of God to be able to say Lean on me, I'm here for you. But Kim was very involved, I mean, she, it was, you would never, she stop in, you know, Kim knew everything that was going on, she was all, you know, it was just, it was like an extension of Kim to have her people. I'm big on being a Christian, and I just feel like that if you have the love of God in your heart, you will take that anywhere. I think that it takes patience, I think that it takes kindness. I, I like to go in and I like to make people happy. First of all, love. I, I let them know and I, I treat them with love. The minute I met Kim, it was just, hi, how are you? I'm Mom, I'm Kim, and that's it. And that's the way it's been. She's a member of our family. I think that's what separates her because it's a personal relationship. It's not a job. It's who she is, it's what she does. Most people that hire me have never been in a situation where they needed a caregiver, so they don't know what to expect. And so once they hire me and they see what comes with caregiving, you know, you, you see relief. You, you, see, and you see people opening up and wanting you to be there. That's one of the best feelings you could ever have is someone welcoming you saying, I'm glad you're here.